What's up guys? We're back for another adventure. Sorry for the shakiness. Forgot to bring my gimbal. Today we are on the north fork of the American River. And we are going to do some crevicing today. Underwater crevicing, sniping as they call it. So that's what we're gonna focus on the entire day. All right, so we made it. It's a new place I haven't been to before. <clears throat> it's a new spot. So what we're gonna do today is we're just gonna do sniping underwater all day. We're gonna give that a go. So I figure when it gets a little cooler, I'll do crevicing outside of the water. And when it gets really hot, I'll just work inside of the water and just relax. Because also the water is gonna be much lower. But let me show you guys where I'm at. All right, so there's a lot of good stuff over here. It's a current right there. Obviously when the current's higher, it's push pushing all this stuff out of here. So it was probably about an hour walk, I'd say, maybe 45 minutes, but it was a tough hike. And I already found a spot over here that I wanna try right there I want to bust those out see if there's anything in there and then I'm gonna have my brew I'm gonna relax for a few minutes put my wetsuit on and go exploring underwater I also got a underwater phone case so I'm gonna capture all the footage underwater to the best of my ability all right guys so I am suited up I'm putting my headgear on my goggles and I'm gonna go dive in and we're gonna see what we could get.
All right, everybody. So I swam around everywhere. I did a lot of crevices that I didn't record. It's just a real pain in the butt trying to do crevicing with a phone in your hand. Um, I didn't even find a single speck, but I did find this. I'm not sure what that is. It could be a piece of platinum, but it's really light. It's really light. I'm thinking, it, is it possibly a really old piece of foil? I don't know, but it's it has really no weight to it. I have no idea what it is. It's strange. All right, so I'm liking this crevice over here. Someone's already worked it, but I'm gonna try to flip these rocks over because it should be going straight under those rocks. <clears throat> so what really sucks about today is that um, as soon as I went in, where's my stuff? Where's my spoon at? But uh, yeah, the thing that sucks today is as soon as I went into the water to do some crevicing or to do some sniping, I lost my, uh, I had my little suction tool on my wrist <laughs> and I was swimming around, swimming around. And then I noticed, I noticed that the top part, the bubble part, the one that you press, it fell off. So I really had no suction tool nothing to suck up the gold with. So I guess that's a good thing. Because if I would have had a real nice spot with much gold, I would have had pretty much no way of taking it out. So this is this looks like a good little spot over here. Some nice clay material. I got about two hours left, so. And I got nothing yet. And that piece of platinum that I found, I, I'm really starting to think that it's a piece of really 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 old foil because it has absolutely no weight to it but i'll hold on to it and i'll check it out so i'm gonna work this area right here some nice clay material coming off of that i really want to get under these rocks that's what i gotta walk back and grab my crowbar So I took my crowbar and I started pushing this rock against these ones and all of this right here is just coming out. That's pretty awesome. It's a lot of material in these. So I'm going to go ahead and get all the material I can out of here and we'll see what we can get. So I just flipped these over. My whole plan was to move that rock, but these ones just all fell apart. So I got all of this material right here. I already saw a little bit of gold. Oh man, and this comes off too. And then there's all that right there. Just all thick clay. Oh man, that's pretty awesome. <laughs> so I'm just gonna go ahead and slowly work all this. That's a lot too. Look at that. Hopefully there's gold in here. Hopefully there's some nice pickers because this area is known for fine gold. I don't need fine gold, guys. I need some big pickers. I've, I've been getting kind of demotivated recently because I haven't really found any big nuggets ever. Maybe I'm doing something wrong. I don't know. But we'll just keep it going. We're not going to stop. You know. It is what it is. As long as you have fun. That's all that matters. This looks like some really good material. Man. Cannot wait to pan this out. And I didn't even get to that yet. That's just thick layers right there. Look. That's just all dirt and clay. Clay material. That's nice. All right, well, once I'm done panning this out, 
I'm gonna update everyone and see what I got. All right, guys, so I've been working that crevice. I moved that rock out of there. I've been getting nothing all day. Absolutely nothing. And, I, and it went down really deep over there. And this is my pan. Some really nice big pieces in here. But man, that's... I'm surprised. I was ready to call it a day. Look at that. That is a big picker. So, yeah, I think I'm gonna keep working that area. I was so demotivated. Oh, you guys have no idea. <clears throat> that is beautiful. I mean, I kept getting flakes and flakes. I'm so tired of flakes. I wanted some real good pieces, you know? But, uh, yeah, that's awesome. I am so happy. And I got a long ways to go in that crevice, too. It keeps going further. So we're going to keep working it. And we're going to see what we get. All right, guys. This trail is no joke. I already have to take two breaks. But that's where there's good gold, I guess. Because it's far, it's up and down, very narrow trails. Man, I've never been this tired. I think this is the tiredest I got. I gotta get on my cardio. That's one of the things about going out in the summertime. If your cardio is not good, it's gonna be tough. Especially when you're going straight up and down mountains. But this trail is kicking my butt. Oh, and I ran out of water, I got no more water. And I can't get to the river. I got about another mile to go. So I'll make it when I make it.